how do you recruit the cult following of a 30-year-old book and transform them into evangelists for a new series? By creating a cult to follow. Meet the Chattering Order of St. Beryl, an order of satanic chattering nuns pulled straight from the Good Omens universe and brought to life as an event hacking, a cappella singing, social media and experiential campaign from, well, hell. The nuns played a pivotal, albeit temporary, role in the series, providing an opportunity for us to create a parallel world around them. In their years since being disbanded, the Chattering Order had formed a choir, written five of their own devious songs, created a website filled with recipes, tour dates, and ways to join the Order, acquired a Beelzebus, and were going on tour to tell everyone about the end of the world, which was also the Good Omen's launch date. Over their five-month journey, the nuns could go where other activations could not, like anywhere they damn well pleased. We'll find out in the next couple of weeks if their time in the spotlight could turn into a lifelong dream come true. We're at South by Southwest. We heard there was chattering going on. Hacking Neil Gaiman's keynote. Do you get security or something? You know I said that I had a cult following. You clearly do. This is, this is that. Yeah. Or their end of Time Square takeover. And we keep To name a few. We evangelized superfans to spread our unholy message by leaking series information to them first. Sisters, the time is coming. Execute Drill 42B. We seduced new audiences with a rich, character-driven story. We beset fans with a plague of original content and ways to interact every day. And we won hearts and souls with epic live performances. And their siren song was in demand. So they answered by recording a new song, releasing a music video, That's brand new. And then dropping an entire album. Now everyone wanted to chatter. Satanic nuns were even invited to sing about the Antichrist on Britain's number one morning show. We need results. Um, they're called impressions. Well, we'll make an impression. By world's end, the nuns had started millions of conversations, became Prime Video's most successful social campaign ever, expanded the cult following to epic proportions, and most importantly, made heartfelt impressions on fans and creators. Good omens indeed.